Easter preparations have begun in our kitchen. We are making marmul today with a different stuffing. This here is pistachio stuffing. And we use a particular mould for this one so that everything looks different. We're using a yellow square mould for this particular one. Once all of that is in place, and that's what it looks like. These particular oval, little oval shaped ones are walnut, walnut filling. This is our dough which we had prepared yesterday and finished off today. Each little ball is weighed at 25 grams, so they're actually quite tiny, just a bite or two. This is the walnut and sugar filling. As you can see, each little one is prepared like a kapkubi. Make a little hole in it, seal it up, and in the mould it goes to give it that lovely shape. This here is also the date filling that we're going to be using to make the largest one and we use the wooden, this particular wooden, wooden mould. We'll come, we'll come to that in a second. Once we, once we finish these, these particular fillings then we start with the, with the date one. There you go, it's quite simple, quite simple to make. It is um, time consuming though, because this was with, with this particular dough, it's got to be prepared um, beforehand, allowed to rest, so that the butter and the semolina um, soak into each other, so that uh, the semolina is, uh, is, not, uh, is not crunchy, and uh, the, the butter soaks right through all the, through all the semolina and it gives it an absolutely beautiful rich flavour. So this is, uh, it's got yeast, it's got what we call mahlab. Mahlab is a, um, is a beautiful flavouring that we put in some of our sweets including, including semolina, including sorry, the, um, the ma'mul. And we'll show you the, the finished products when, when they come out of the oven. We'll open up one for you and show you how they go.